Okay, um, at this stage what we're going to do is we're going to take our, our ring and uh, glue it on top of our stators. Now, if you got your stators on here nice and square, um, you should have uh, you know, a, a pretty easy time uh, getting this to all line up. Now, more than likely, your ring is not going to be perfectly flat. Okay, if it's perfectly flat and you got all these perfectly level, then it'll fit on there just, just nice. But uh, chances are this is going to be a little warped. And so what we want to do is you want to place this ring right on center. And I'm going to, I'm going to glue mine using just our, our, our wood glue. Uh, you can use the 5 minute epoxy if you like. I, I like the wood glue. It gives me a little more uh, working time. And um, so I'm, I'm just going to take um, and uh, put, put the wood glue on top of each stator. Uh, we're going to reinforce these later. Uh, but right now we're just going to get these glued down. And so go ahead and you know put a put a generous amount of glue on there. Um, and then you know any dripping you get off the side, just you know after we uh, put our our ring on top, go ahead and we'll clean that up. And, uh, okay, like so. And then. Um, I'm going to take the ring and lay it on. And what we want to do is you want to make sure this is centered and make sure that none of the uh, stators intrude into the inner ring. Make sure that they're all inside. Okay, we're going to be able to uh, move our center on our lid because we're actually going to we're going to put our rotor in later, center up our rotor, and then we're going to then we're going to uh, fix our lid to the top of this uh, based on having trued up the rotor so but the, but we don't want any of these uh, stators intruding into in into the inner part of the ring okay is, is the main thing now I'm going to use clamps to bring mine down however if all you have is um, you know some five gallon or excuse me one gallon paint can don't put a five gallon paint can up there you can do that and put them around the circle until you, you can get everything to come down. Now, if you have these uh, these handy wood clamps like I have right here, this is a much better option. And I can come in and just spin this around. And, and you don't want to clamp it so much to warp it. You just want to clamp it just enough so that it's all making contact. So you can see, you can clamp these down, and, uh, and, and, and right now it's the time to go ahead and uh, you know, get your rag and clean up any glue drips and stuff, uh, easier now than later. And so go ahead and glue your top ring on like that. Uh, if you have to, have to use, use the weights, that's fine. If you have the clamps, that's better. So, okay, take care of that, and I'll see you at the next operation.